Thanks. You're a winner every time, Sean. Thanks. You're a winner every time, Sean. That means school starts tomorrow. I figured if I didn't think about it, it would just go away. fun of me. You thought it, though. And don't deny it. I've known you too long for you to be able to lie to me anymore. Anyway, I gotta go find John. Happy school day! School starts tomorrow, so we're calling to do our good luck cheer. You're never too old for us to love you. And I'm never too old for a good luck cheer. I'm waving a flag with your name on it. Can you hear? So, how's that? <laughs> it's a good thing he's got you to look. Sure did. Your new campus is lovely, and we did our best to make. The school said it's fine as long as you go see your advisor. Uh, yeah. Don't implant your silly nickname in her head. It's Professor Kovalt. And your dad thinks that he looks like a hitman. Don't you see it? Come on, the suit, the stern look. The school said it's fine as long as you go see your advice. Don't you see it? Missing orientation will put your daughter at a severe disadvantage. Doesn't that sound ominous? I still say he's secretly a hitman. Anyway. We just wanted to let you know we're proud. We love you!
proper syllabus. You can find a seat near the back. Your assignment for next time is to read the first chapter and finish the first set. Looks like we have someone who's having trouble seeing. Hello, don't be shy. Come forward. I saw you jumping up and down in the back. Hey, hey me too. We should... Sorry for being so forward. Would you mind sharing your name with me? Sean. That's a lovely name. I'm Benito, but you can call me Ben for short. Well, some people believe you can use psychic powers for luck, love, and all sorts of things. We're going to test psychic ability for you. Is that okay? What I want is for you to think about a card for me. You don't have to make a huge production out of it or anything. Just close your eyes and block everything else out. Let it go dark and imagine the card in your mind. Got it? Open your eyes. Now, really focus on the energy of that card. If you think hard enough, you may be able to find it. Don't let go of that thought in your mind. Really focus on that card. All right, don't turn your card over just yet. Now, what was the card you were thinking of? Turn your card over. Looks like you really are psychic, Sean. You can keep that if you want. You're the psychic one, right? Do a trick for me! Well, let's have a look.
She told me that Adam Eaton was in her class this morning. I didn't even know he went here. Jealous? I wish I had a class with Adam. In ancient Greece, theater was divided into two distinct genres, comedy and tragedy. These genres were represented by the goddesses Talia and Melpomene. Your assignment for tonight, write a single page summary of the Greek playwright of your choice. Due tomorrow, include style, famous works, and his influence on modern storytelling. There are strict style guidelines on the course website. Read them before you begin. If you have any questions, my office hours are also posted on the website. I need it for my major. Ciao. Actually, I wanted to see you again. Are you interested in being a plant? Do you want to hang out in crowds and help me do a few tricks? Don't be silly, you were great today. I try, but there are a few tricks here and there that require a helper in the audience. Think of it as rigging the deck. They don't have the right look. A plant has to be plain and not stand out, otherwise it's too obvious. Yeah, I mean... Note to self, don't call people plain, even if you mean it as a compliment. Most people have a sort of air about them, something that screams, please notice me. They're desperate for attention, and it shows in the way they dress, move, and speak. But you're different. You don't look like you want attention. You shy away from it. Well, think about it. I know you'd be great. Not all, but some, sure. You'd learn plenty from helping me anyway. Are you saying you'll help? That trick's a bit of an obvious one, though. Every card in the deck is a four of clubs. You must just be psychic. Anyway, I'm sure you have somewhere to be, so I won't keep you. Text me later, okay? It's there. I was afraid you were someone else asking for an autograph. I'm still not that popular. I doubt the whole school even knows who I am. Maybe I should go around with a hat and sunglasses to protect my identity.
Not bad. I was late to my first class. I didn't actually know what it was. Hey, hey, in case you don't remember, I was putting on a concert last night in a city six hours away. Oh, I remember. I also remember that you fell asleep on the bus before the rest of us. For you, my professor decided to make an example out of me, so I had to stand in front of the class and explain why I slept in. I don't think he recognized me, so when I said I was putting on a concert, he didn't believe me. Then some girl pulled out her phone and showed him my sight, and the whole class kind of fell apart when there was someone asked for an autograph, then someone else told me to sing, and a group of guys in the back started singing. I think Professor Kovald is gonna... If I die in my sleep, you know what happened. not trying. Anyway, how is your... Oh man, this tour before school thing was probably a bad idea, huh? Same here. Shall we go together? classes only. John's idea. He said I should reserve the afternoons for work. That's his job after all. after another right now. Insurance only covers part of it, and he won't be able to work. It's okay, honey. I can ask for extra hours at... No, no. To be honest, I didn't even... I was afraid you'd worry too much, and you... I know. I will. Yes. Don't worry, Sean. We'll find a way to make it work. I know, hun. I... I love you too, Sean. Sean! You're not gonna believe this! Whoa. You're really gonna just lie like that? What? Is he okay? Hey, you gonna buy that or what? <sighs> Freshman. Oi, shut up, guy. She's got a lot on her mind right now. Uh-huh. They don't really pay me enough to care. Do they pay you to be a jerk, or are you always like this? I've got it. Must be nice having a sugar daddy.
I'm really in the mood to punch something right now. What, I'm not allowed to have emotions about things? I can help, you know, with school expenses and stuff. Now's not really the time to be stubborn. I make plenty of money. Advisor? Oh, I guess I should schedule one of those meetings then. Huh. Are you sure you'll be okay? Sure, whatever you want. Come in. Sean Gooden, yes? Have a seat. students first am I excellent there are so many unusual names I always worry that I'm saying something in of course I find my name to be a wholly commonplace but in other places it must be rather exotic how are you liking your first day say that for my sake. I won't be offended. I hope it's not too rude of me to ask what's on your mind. for students to hold jobs. But you might be interested in this. Your current situation sounds like it might count. If you're approved, the school will lower your tuition as long as you maintain a C grade or higher. Tuition is expensive, and we know it, but we... Don't thank me. It's my job. Have you thought about a major for yourself yet? There's no rush to decide immediately, but you should keep it in mind as you take your classes. Very well. That's all I wanted to talk about. You can bring that form back to me or drop it in the office mailbox. like I'm set for dinner tonight. I'm glad you came. I didn't think you'd actually accept. Oh yeah? Well, what do I need to do to convince you? I 
see. I'm afraid that I don't have much money to offer, but I'm currently in the talks for a TV special right now. If it comes through, that'll pay pretty well. What happened? Something happened to you after we met this morning. Don't try to hide it. It's my job to read people, and right now it's clear as day to me that you're in pain. And now you need money? See? That wasn't so hard, was it? Well, the TV deal is still a ways off, but if you really are strapped for cash, why don't you start a blog? It's no cash cow, but it's better than nothing. You'd have to update it regularly, though. I don't know. What's your area of expertise? How am I supposed to look? You're not even wearing any makeup, and yet the... You're a professional makeup artist? You have a fascinating outlook on things. To me, at least. I hope I'll get to study you more sometime. Sorry to cut things short, but I have to get back to if I'm lucky. I'll be able to upgrade tonight's dinner to a medium combo. Stay in touch, okay? Is there something you wanted to share with the class? You're welcome to text or chat with your friends, but don't do it here. Anyone who shows up to class should be all here. If you're not interested in being here,
entry. You'll have to go line up in the front. The crew's already all inside, set. Well, you can go see Adam once... What's she doing? I think she's trying to sneak in. Don't make me use force. Totally posted. It's all right, she's in. This girl's Adam's makeup artist. Sorry about that, Mr. Brandon. You know how it is. That I do, and we're mighty grateful you're so strict. So, shall we head inside? Sure. Why didn't you call? I gave you my mobile number for a reason. Well, that's not true at all. Sean, do you know what bothers me? Having a makeup artist bothers me. Getting a ring on the phone? Not so much. The guard was doing his job. What about you? You look ready to turn tail and hide when a simple... That's not shyness, it's selfishness. You're uncomfortable doing something, so instead of pushing through, you hide behind your own insecurity. I'm not the one who chose you. Adam did. And you were a... What do you want, Sean? Should I coddle you and tell you it's okay to run away? I'm not your nanny. Suit yourself. Adam's down there, by the way. Try not to. <coughs> Whoa. What happened? And then? Is that all? That bad, huh?
Does John know about you and crowds? Don't say that. You're the smartest person I know. So, about your dad... Good. It's been on my mind all day, you know. Your dad's a cool guy, and you're my best friend. Of course I'm... It's just nothing. I'm gonna worry about you whether you like it or not. How many years have we known each other? Exactly, so none of this don't worry about me nonsense. Anyway, it's go time. Wish me luck. You know it! I'm so tired, though. Do I... Well, you should have stopped me. Ow! You're gonna make me stupid if you keep hitting me on the head like that. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm already stupid. You didn't have to. I can see it in your eyes. I'm glad you're less worried. You were starting to get wrinkles. You definitely were. I said you were getting wrinkles, not anymore. No, I really don't think it does. Are we heading back to campus or what? You're wasting time, Sean. You know me. Come on, let's go back together.
stay quiet and don't move. I told you not to move. Please, don't move. Maybe he went to a different studio? Please, please. Maybe he went to a different... I really thought I saw him go... Well, let's keep looking. No, it's my fault. I'm the one who grabbed you. It was pretty rude of me to... I'm so sorry! Those girls were chasing me, and then I panicked, and... I'm not sure. I'm supposed to be filming a commercial, but one of the crew members posted a photo of the studio online. A bunch of them figured out we were here, and I guess they wanted to see the shoots. And then it looked like they wanted to talk to me, so I kind of ran away. I'm usually not this bad. They just caught me by surprise. I didn't think anyone would want to talk to me. How can you tell? Oh, I see. You're really smart. Maybe. But girls are scary. Uh-huh. Oh, that's next door. Just take the main hallway out. It's the building right in front of you. Oh, um, Matthew. <laughs> Thanks. Sean! I was just about to come looking for you. Wait, you are Sean, right? No, 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 it's fine. I'm the director and producer, Lloyd Newton. <laughs> You're not late at all. I was just fretting that you were going to be carted off with those other girls. Security said a couple teenage girls tried to crat and was worried that you were taking no trouble. Great! Then let's get started. So... Right. Although we usually call it a pilot presentation, we basically spend one day putting together shots to show networks what the show would be like. If it's good enough, a network will pick it up and we'll get to make a series. We're tentatively calling it Cops and Robbers, name subject to change. It's a crime drama, lots of things blowing up. Not a fan of explosions? <laughs> It's probably better for you if you don't. I hear watching violent shows turns you into a criminal. Your job is to make sure all our actors look pretty. 
no easy task, I assure you. The trailers are that way, and I'll see you on set. I'm looking forward to seeing what you've got. I've heard only great things about you. Is this wardrobe? You look rather young. Is this your first gig? Do you plan to make a career out of this? Or are you just doing this to pass the time until your big break? Are you planning to become an actress? Good for you. Of course. Something in a police station. of the hard-hitting, tough nature. It's television, honey. You're pretty or you're comedic relief. No one cares about realism. Thank you. Selena, my beautiful leading lady. The boys already put your marks down. Not bad, Sean. Tough and beautiful. Oh, modesty is for suckers. Next time. Quiet on the set. Rolling. Cops and robbers. Scene eight, take one. And action! Chief, he's out there killing people without worrying about protocol. We can't keep playing by the same rules. Reset, still rolling? Action! Cops and robbers, scene eight, take two. Chief, he's out there killing people without worrying about protocol. If you won't do anything about it, I will. If you won't do anything about it, I will. Good, good. Reset, still rolling? Give me something different. Cops and robbers, scene eight. Don't try to stop me. Cut. Beautiful. All right, reset. We're going again. All right, reset. That's a wrap. I hope to see you all again soon. Well done, Sean. I knew I could count on you. You look ready to collapse. Hmm. Caffeine, mostly. Oh, and good food. I just found this pho place downtown, and it's amazing!
The only place I've been that makes it better is Vietnam. That good. You should check it out sometime. Right. Good home and get some sleep. And good work today. Cold? Lloyd's an old mate of mine. I was just popping by to see how filming went. I'd be lying if I said no. You're the only makeup artist in the area I know, and it was rather an emergency. Where are you going? Do you need a lift? It's cold out and you need a lift. I can provide one. It's no more complex than that. You'd prefer it otherwise. Well then, let's get you back, shall we? I hope work... I hope work went well for you today. Don't be shy. If you think I'm good with people, I must be a better actor than I thought. I'm terrified. Acting is about being vulnerable, about showing the most raw parts of yourself and hoping that people don't walk all over it. When I was first cast as Knight, I was certain that everyone would hate my performance. At that point in time, I was entirely unheard of. I spent hours pacing back and forth in my tight. It was the chance to finally be known. Everyone but me. Every time I watch it, I see things that make me cringe. There's a Still, there's no sense in dwelling on the past. You haven't seen it. No, no need to apologize. It's not a requirement to know me. I... Don't bother unless you like fantasy and Brits. You don't... The character Knight is such a legendary hero, I'm... I suppose that I'm trying to escape from him. After three seasons, it's difficult... But the truth is, if I can't escape the image of a single character, then... But that's neither here nor there. This is your university, yes? Honey, are you all right? Are you hurt? Your father is awake. At the moment, the doctors think it was just exhaustion. They had to let a few people go, so your father has been pulling extra shifts. 
tourism has been down. The hotel just isn't making as much as it used to. The good news is that the bulk of his recovery is simply lots of rest and... He was stalking some high shelves when he collapsed. His kneecap broke into several pieces, so they'll be putting... He says he's hoping to get a robot eye as well. They'll be letting him go in a week, but they say that the first stage of recovery will take several weeks, so... So far, everything is going smoothly. They say that if he... I'm calling to see how you're doing. Because you'll never think to worry about yourself. I'm sorry. We're your parents. We're supposed... Sean. What about your studies? Just don't fall behind on your studies, alright? I have to get back to your father now. I will. <laughs>